Hey, babe. I was thinking maybe you had a good idea going to bed early. Hope you don't mind me joining you. Holy crap. Uh, I'm pretty sure you didn't mean for me to see that. My first thought is to ask if you're okay, but I think it's pretty clear you're not. I have to ask, baby. And I need you to be honest with me. You, you, you weren't trying to. You know, th this wasn't an, uh, an attempt at something more serious. Okay. I, I needed to ask. I, I, I understand this wasn't, uh, that... I'm sorry. I, I was not expecting this. I mean, I, I know this uh, happens, but I didn't. I, I didn't see you were hurting like this. I'm sorry. I'm just sorry, babe. I kind of don't know what to do, babe. I don't want to make this about me. Because your needs are most important right now, but I need some help here. I, I don't know what to do. I've never walked in while you were, you know, uh, uh, and and again. I know this isn't about me, but I feel I have to say this in case you need to hear it. I really, really don't want you to hurt yourself. Let me, let me, let me say that again. I really, really don't want you to hurt yourself. But if, if, if that's what you feel you need to do, please be safe. I, I know I can't stop you, but please, please be safe. Also, it's very important that you know that I'm not angry with you. I'm overwhelmed, confused, sad, worried, and so, so many other things, but not angry. The way I see it, we have two options here. 
I will do whatever you need me to do. I can turn around, go back into another room and let you do what you feel you need to do. I don't want to judge you and I don't want you to feel guilty or ashamed, but I have to be honest, I won't be able to think about anything else, but why my favorite person on the planet is in a room alone, hurting themselves, and I'm not doing anything to help them. But if... If that's what you need from me, I promise to do as you wish. But, I think I have a better option. I know we talked about how you want to stop uh, coping this way. So, if you'll let me, I'd like to stay and see if I can help. If, if at any point you need me to give you some space, I, I, I promise I, I will. I'll go hang out in the living room or something until you tell me you're ready for me to see you, okay? Maybe? What would you like me to do? Thank you. I'd like it if I stayed too. Do you want me to stay over here or can we both sit on the bed? Okay, I'm, I'm coming over there now. So, Babe, uh, here we are. What can I do for you right now to help? Distract you or help you with an alternative? Give you a hug? Hold you? Where do we start? Maybe, um, can I try to stop the bleeding for you? Not ready to let me do that yet. I, I know you maybe feel a little, um, maybe embarrassed or awkward, but you don't need to be. I don't mind. I've, I've helped you clean up. Um, after other times, I'm not sure why you don't, um, I don't understand why not. Okay. 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 Not now. I'm, I'm fine with helping though. Whenever you're ready. Can we talk about how we got here? You've told me before this this happens for lots of different reasons. Let's let's figure this out, okay? It might help us find you a better way to cope. You've said sometimes you're trying to stop feeling something, and sometimes you're trying to feel something other than numbness. Is it that? Or, uh, 
Is it because you're hurting inside and need the distraction of physical pain? Or are you feeling bad about yourself? Like you need to be hurt because you think you somehow deserve it? Oh, baby. You you don't deserve it. No one deserves pain. Wait, is... Is that why you don't want me to take care of... Oh, babe. No. No, 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 no. I think... Okay. Um, I think you've been hurt enough. You deserve to be loved. You deserve kindness, gentleness. Maybe I could show you that. Can, can I try, please? Let's start with something easy. Maybe you'd like to set th th that down somewhere. Would you let me take it? I can just set it over here, okay? Thanks, sweetheart. I appreciate that. Here, you can put your head against my chest, baby. Is that all right? There you go. So, baby, what is it that you think makes you Deserving of so much hurt. Did you hurt someone else? That doesn't sound like you. No. So, uh, what makes you so worthy of all this self hatred? I I know someone probably told you that but it's just not true. You are one of the kindest people I know. You're smart and talented and beautiful. No. I know so many people have treated you that way, but you are not someone who deserves pain. I don't really think anyone deserves pain, but definitely not you. I don't know. I'm not sure why people did that to you. And I'm so sorry they did that, but it wasn't because you deserved it. They were probably very unhappy people, and you, because you're so gentle, you were an easy target for their unhappiness. They knew you wouldn't strike back at them. That happens a lot to people who, well, people have been hurt like you have. 
you kind of get used to not fighting back because you've been in so many situations where it did you no good. And certain people tend to spot that and take advantage. But the thing is, you never deserved any of that pain. Not ever. Yes. Definitely I can give you a hug. Mm. There. Oh, babe. I'm so sorry you're feeling this way. I don't know what I can say to convince you, but those people who hurt you, who made you feel like this, they were wrong. They were wrong. I know my saying that, it probably feels like nothing compared to the mountain of hurt you're dealing with. It's, it's like this band-aid I put on your body. It's a small thing. It doesn't really fix anything. It doesn't really ease the pain, but I hope that it's some help in trying to help you get better, you know? I know it's really important right now that you have complete control of your body, and I promise I will respect that, okay? But, you know, this... This isn't going to help in the long run, right? I know you maybe feel like this is the best you can do to cope right now, but there are better ways, and we can find them together. I know right now it just might not be possible for you to, to stop. And that's all right. But I want you to be able to be honest with me. No matter what. I can't help if I don't know. In the future, can you please... Tell me when you're feeling this way. Maybe I can distract you or help you so you don't feel like you need to do this. Maybe we can try some of the alternatives, the ones your therapist suggested. Even if I'm somewhere else, call me and tell me what you're feeling. I promise I'll do my best to help you get through these feelings, and if we can, not hurt yourself. I'd like even more for you to not want to hurt yourself. I'd like to see your scars healing, and your heart healing too. Hmm. I think you'd like that also. <laughs> Come here, babe. Let's just go to bed early. Like we said we were going to. Let me let me hold you until we fall asleep, okay? I know we can't fix everything right now, but Getting some rest can't hurt. Come here. I'll be the big spoon. Good night, my love.